Welcome, 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 YouTubers, to another edition of Dan Sinclair Quick Fire Interviews. You know, Dan Sinclair, the leader in sound system online culture. So just big up yourself, Dan Sinclair. A big up self, I'm Uli Cooley. I'll be your host today, Sean T. All right, people. Who we have here? Back in the foundation. Back to the beginning where it all started when it comes to sound system scene. So let me introduce to you none other than the great Wolfman. Respect. it. And the great man for Bill. Yes, sir. From none other than Mo Ambassa Sound. Yeah? Yeah. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you. So we got this quick fire interview, Bridget. Yes, sir. Yeah, we're just gonna fire some questions and we're just gonna keep it flowing now. Flowing, yeah, yeah. flowing. Alright. So as you know, we already um done a piece with one member of my ambassador, and this is another half of the great sound system. Okay? It's for all you don't know. So let's just start from this. How did the name my ambassador come around? Right? Well, it's um, we never wanted to be like a sir or a lad, so uh, it was um, big youth. We was talking and we said we would like to find the Amwick word for uh, for conquering lions. So that's when big youth went to the Ethiopian embassy. Correct. And from that we found out that the name was Mwambasa. So. Which oh, means conquering lion, well, Moa, uh, conquering, and ambassador, ambassador means lion. lion. Uh, for those that don't know about Amric, Amric is the uh, one of the original languages of the Ethiopians. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. yes, yes, yes. Yeah. And just to note as well, Big U is one of the other founder members of yeah. Mwambasa. Wow. Uh, yeah. We yeah. called him Big U, Irving Dumont. Yeah. Uh, okay. To, uh, like me, we were slightly younger than some of the <laughs> them right now. Big, <laughs> 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 was that you? Uh, uh, nice, nice. So what, what inspired you to start the sound? Well, we actually came from Lord David. Lord David was a, a foundation sound from Battersea okay. in the day and uh, we had two clubs there. Yeah, two clubs, uh, Balham's Caxton. Dance Studio okay, and, Caxton. Yeah. and Caxton. And we kind of really basically started our uh, Apprentice with him, yeah. uh, and then it reached a point and a level where there was quite a bit of financial gain going on, mm -hmm. and okay. uh, we just thought, well, it wasn't really coming our way. Yeah, and um, you know, as young people, we just started to get disgruntled and thought, you know, maybe we need to set up our own independent thing. Yeah, yeah. And hence, that's how we began to move into our own independent okay. sound system more and better. Mm. Okay. So I'll tell you what, um, describe yourself, what kind of sound are you? A uh, party sound, a killing sound, a nice sound, a... Dub sound. Dub sound, rubber dub. dub. <laughs> rubber dub, really, we is a rubber dub song, but we also play, you know, mm. we is a really a Rasta, Rasta song, oh. because we was, that's what we wanted to represent Rasta, mm -hmm. because there wasn't a Rasta song there. That time Coxon was, I think he was in Manchester at that Wolverhampton. time. Wolverhampton. Wolverhampton was yeah. at that time. And it was really slack. Everything in London never did a really a kick. And we started Mwambasa and from day one, it just exploded. Okay. Can I just add to that as well? That's because, um, you know, for us, everybody was there and they're talking and we're thinking, oh, okay, well, everybody's naming themselves off of themselves again, me, yeah. me, me, me kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. And we just never wanted to be like that because as Rastafarians, it was about, we used to say, I and I and I and I, meaning we're including everybody. Yeah. So, um, hence we thought, you know what, this Carl is something Mom, we own. And I have to say to you, right, uh, there was no people of our age that owned their sound. Okay. We were the only young people at that age. See. So we were kind of despised by some people. Okay. Because we are some because you would play a comic by you know, we we confident yeah. and, and <laughs> certain people and, didn't like it. And also <laughs> we took a year to form the sound. We never just came out, we prepared ourselves. Okay. We had we had two pieces of six when we first came out. 
valve this yeah. was. Uh, my friend died golden, built the, the boxes, so yeah. we had boxes. We were prepared. We never just came out as a small sound. Uh, we came out as a large sound. Okay. Also to add a note to that, uh, our boxes were what we said, ice, golden yeah. green, meaning yes. red, yes. golden yes. green. Yeah. So yeah. people were looking at like, wow. What the heck is this? See, you know, so it was another visual. thing that was unique visual. to more okay. so, so back in the day, did, did you use the, did you clash anybody or I don't know what was your first sound clash was Coxon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. yeah. Imagine, <laughs> was imagine. It we <laughs> we was out. I think we were in the first year. Coxon came from Wolverhampton. He heard what was going on, yeah. and he said, "You might have put one out with players." Okay. So that was Matthew's church. Matthew's church. Yeah. I think the, the, the Festus referred to that so, yeah, a couple Festus, of times yeah, when I was watching. Yeah. Yes, that is his in fear sweet. So uh, what's your what's, what's your what's your take on that dance there? My personal take is is that I thought we came out together. I yeah, don't think okay. he really dominated anything. Okay. Um, okay. And yet he was right. I think I remember him talking about that he came in with some amplifier. Yeah, and he true. turned up. He sounded true. much better. Can't dispute that. He sounded yeah, much okay. better. Really bad, good. But, but we were just, we had just came out that year, so he yeah. should have yeah, sounded yeah, better. Yeah, for yeah. real. For you real. understand yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. So the way he was going on, I don't. Think. Yeah, and we stood our ground and held our ground. Yeah. As young you know, <laughs> that <laughs> yeah. yeah, so that was the first one, Saint Mark's true, Church, true. Or, which is in Battersea. Okay. Do you have any more, like, um, was there any other dances that, that, that stick out in your mind from those early days? Early days, it, I remember we went to Birmingham mm -hmm. and we was at Wilson Green. I don't know if you know, there's a prison, a Wilson Green prison, and in front of it there's a hall and we was playing Quaker City and I think wow. Christopher. Yeah, wow. and I think Jungle Man was there too. And I think wow. Jungle Man <laughs> was there. <laughs> okay. And, Sorry, let's stick up here. What year was this, brother? 77, 78. Yeah, yeah. Around that. Yeah. Yeah. And for every speaker we had, Quaker City had two. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, I know they were big sounds. Yeah. And he never wanted us to play. No? No, 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 no. Because he knew we come from London with a bugger tune. Yeah. But he had the sounds. And I just. Well, and a couple of men go up on the mic and say, does the people them want to hear music? Okay. And the people them realize, and now some of the big church them, Congo Nati them, yeah. so even afterwards they said, come let's play a house party. See. They were so impressed with us. They were so yeah. impressed with us. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? And we played the house party the Saturday night and I think we played even the Sunday. Yeah, I think, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, right in that same vicinity, yeah. Winston yeah. Green. Um, yeah, just to, to note as well that, you know, Quaker City, when he put down themes on bridge and it's like... It's the heaviest... <laughs> <thing>. <laughs> yeah. 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 You can't just do that, that yeah. gets fucked. No. Yeah. And nobody Be can't say nothing. Beat your heart out. So, <laughs> so love to him too and, and yeah. all of those sounds in Birmingham. Yeah. Jungle Man, yeah. Quaker City, Mafia Tone. What a sound Mafia Tone yeah. is. Mafia Tone. Yeah. And there's Stuff. a couple of others that they can't recall. Okay. So, yeah. so you know, you're talking about the quality of sound of, of, of Quaker City, which is a, it's a great He memory. was built, uh, the same person who built Quaker City sound built our sound. Okay. Wow. There was two, two L's. Yeah. There was Earl who made um, Coxon <coughs> sound, okay. and there was Earl who made, well, from Northland who made Fat Man and Quaker City sound, see, as well as our sound. See, see, see. And to me, and Suffer, in fact, yeah, and true. Suffer, Suffer. Suffer. Suffer sound, sound yes. too. Yeah. Yeah. So all of those sounds, they sounded strong. Mm -hmm. Even Lord David, he made Lord David sound. Oh, okay. That's why we went to him. So what, what, what's, what's, what's the main ingredient? Can you name like maybe a few things that, that you believe is the most important things to when you're starting a sound that, that you kind of need? Because you're talking about quality of, of sound. So what You've got to have old time too. Mm -hmm. You have to, you know, 45, because when we first played out, we played out in a house party. Yeah. And we had to have 40, because we had left the sound and we couldn't have, taken any of the records so we had to, you know yeah. we had to build it up 
and we went to um, my man in our West London and um, Studio and One. Uh, Studio One, Pekin. 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 The mm. first place we went to is Pekin, <coughs> and we got our Studio One, and we, you know, from there we got um, some Channel One because Channel yeah. One yeah. was doing it there. Mm -hmm. Joe mm -hmm. Gibbs, just you, you know, uh, two sevens clash. Yes. Because that's when we came out, you had people like Culture, Burning Spear. Yeah, 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 yeah. Also, you know, obviously the sound quality is, is mega important. Yeah. You know what I mean? You've got good top section, which yeah. we used to play Tanoi. Uh, and we had a few horns. Horns. And, yeah. and what we called tweeters at that yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. And then we had a middle section, again, yeah. which had to be yeah. clean, crisp. Inch. And then the bottom section was something else. We used to use some different speakers, but yeah. in a sense, yeah. Then when I use some speaker, where kind of regular everyday thing, yeah. and we we researched, yeah, we and we so. brought some speakers which were called Gauss, yeah, Gauss. at the time. Gauss. Gauss. Yeah. Yeah. Most of the time they were using crescendo or, Fain, go or good ones, yeah, yeah, and, and, yeah. and they were only like a hundred watts. Well, the Gauss now was two hundred watts. Wow. So if you put two of them into one box, yeah. it's almost like you had four speakers. See. So you never used to have the four, you never used to keep four in a one box? No David, yeah, no David, David. Yeah. not with Mwambasa. Okay. Yeah. No, because what happened, you'd, you, you'd lose a lot of the power. Okay. You know, we never, because we, we were making them ourselves. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, incidentally, again, you know, with, with the sound, uh, of course, you need a good turntable All right. and um, a good stylus needle. And them time the man I play with the same old thing, we had what we call Stanton. Yeah. And this is kind of years ahead technology yeah. Yeah. prior to what everybody else is playing. Yeah, yeah. And, and also we had a very good preamp and we had yeah. sound effects. We were one of the first sounds. Yeah, to, to, to actually, I mean, there was we're sound effects up. prior, you know, like yeah. they had this what we call um, spring uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. echo, yeah, 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 which yeah, yeah. Cox and them used to use. But we had what we call uh, a space echo, completely right, yeah. different. But this is something like they might use in a professional yeah. studio. Is that yeah. the one that had the tape inside? Tape inside. No, no, that's yeah. the copycat. Oh, okay. That's called a copycat. Copycat. Yeah, the okay. one with the tape. This oh, yeah, is, yeah, 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 we yeah. did have that. See, yeah, and then yeah, we yeah, 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 progressed yeah, 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 into yeah. the into the uh, okay. space, space roll and space echo. Roll and space echo, yeah. Yeah, yeah so, yeah. you know, we were looking to be cutting edge and be different. Yeah. You know, yeah. and be a bit more unusual and... Mm -hmm. So we took the sound thing seriously. Quality... But uh, I'll be honest with you, a lot of the old sounds never liked it. Why? Because you had, like, people like Duke Vin and people like that. And when we were playing them, they expected us to kind of respect them. And we never, <laughs> you know, at the end of the day, we wanted to make our, yeah. our name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yes, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. So you know about the quality of the sound, the music. So, Mom Basa was a dub plate sound to Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. So yeah. That, that leads me yeah. to this question. Can you name your top three dubs? Yeah, I would definitely say... Mom Basa make it work. Mom Basa make it work, so. I would definitely say... Um, Victory Horns. Victory Horns and um, Ronnie, D well, um, um, Ronnie Davis. Ronnie Davis, cover me. Cover me. Yeah, give me two more. Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, you put that Yabba. Yabba. Yabba, well, we were killing Yabba. Yabba, you, you um, killing. Fire, fire. Upset, um, um, yeah, fire, fire. Yabba, you. King Tobbies. Oh, King wow. Tobbies. It's just King a Tobbies. Yes. And skin, flesh, and bones. Um, yeah, okay. Very much. Um, nice. Yeah. Then that's what we were about. Joe Gibbs, Nine, Observer, Channel One, Channel Set One. Up. But we were. It was all those. Randy's at that time had gone. It's not so important. Yeah. yeah. You know the newer studios were coming out and doing. Fresh things. We're gonna talk about that. Mm -hmm. We're gonna talk about that. What was your first dub? Can you remember the first dub that you ever brought? Police Santi. Wow. Lee Scratch Perry. Lee Scratch yeah. Perry personally caught it for it. Yeah. 
that time we were at, at Island Music, which yeah. is where uh, Scratch was working with Bob. Yeah. And all that kind of thing. And we were kind of introduced to that circle. All same through. Yeah, right. by a guy called Delroy Washington. Oh, who's okay. a very famous mm -hmm. reggae artist. Yeah, yeah. First yeah. British reggae artist that was signed to a major. Oh, and he introduced us to all of those people. All of them. Not respected Delroy Washington. All of them. Yeah. So, um, as you know, it's a quick fire team. Mm -hmm. So, you listen to other types of music? Yeah. Yeah. What's, oh, your, cool. what's your other favourite music that you like? I mean, to I have to, to say, Blood, I was born and bred here in Britain. So, we yeah. grew up with everything. Whether it's pop, rock, blues, mm. jazz, funk, uh, R&B, soul. And also, when we were growing up, reggae and soul were together. That's together. right. And then together. all of a sudden, this is by about 1976, uh, it split. It's split. And, and it's like soul it's was split. over there if you and reggae was over if there. If you went to um, Colombo's, let's just say Colombo's, where Coxon was, yeah. Every people from North, South, East, and West went to Columbus, mm -hmm. and they would be here in um, I don't ring my bell, and they'd be here in Slavery. I was born Slavery by Light Park. Yeah, at the same time. So yeah, it was like one thing. It was, you know, it was a thing. bit strange how the thing just teal off, and then no, when we as Mombasa. Are playing soul sometimes. Man, I look at all them money I play for them Rasta. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't give a damn. No, because no, we yeah. know that music is music, and like Bob said, when the music hits you, you feel no pain. Yeah. And for me, it's all about melody. The melody is good. And music. another thing I must mm. have to say is that if uh, um, most of the radio records are soul records. That's anyway. a good point. True, true. You know, true, true. Um, Curtis Mayfield, yeah. Queen of the Minstrels, yes. right. all of that, yeah. Gypsy yeah. Woman. Yeah. You know, they were carry out Sam Cooks yeah. and yeah, exactly. yeah. Yeah. all of those and, guys. And as you know, mm -hmm. a lot of us are aware of that whole uh, country western R and B thing. Yep. Which that was the only thing that they were playing in Jamaica. Yeah. yeah. Them didn't have playing already no way. Yeah. Until kinda later. Well the stations on Sunday. Were, weren't playing reggae at yeah. all until yeah. their eighties. Yeah. So hence that's how we got a lot of these yeah. reggae artists singing those cover versions. And and yeah. into reggae. Yeah. Cause you man, a true foundation sound system. You you're born and grown sound system. I know this. You you, you came through and you, you with a great sound and you was a great contribution to sound system then. What do you think about sound system now? Um, my personal opinion is, I think it's a good thing that the sound systems are still going. Mm -hmm. And you know, obviously the sound has changed. You, you've got a small amount of equipment and the little amp that you can get crate output which yeah. I love and I yeah. think is all good that's good um, sometimes I think that it's like the music side of it and I just think well you know it's like they just up here the one thing and it's like there's no variation yeah. uh, and, and in our day and although Lloyd said that Mombasa was a dub sound uh, we never just played dub all the time no we used to play uh, lots of variations of reggae, whether it was Lover's Rock, uh, Lover's Rock kind of came, it yeah. evolved through Dennis Bovell. Yeah, it was a that in mind. Yeah, and, but we never used to call it Lover's Rock because as far as we were concerned, we were playing Lover's Rock way before this British so-called Lover's sound yeah. came around. Yeah. Mm -hmm. With Gregory Isaac, Delroy Wilson, mm -hmm. this man, they're all Lover's Rock. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And we're talking about some killer Lover's Rock, if we mm -hmm. want to talk about that sugar yeah. might not even yeah, personally yeah, come yeah. over because at that stage why even lovers what came about is yeah. because the women wanted lovers yeah. yeah and what was coming out of jamaica is truth and rights and you know the woman then kind of fed up by it they want to go up the man and and we did too. We wanted to grab the women so we're playing playing so you so with those things still going in adults in the same way you think in nowadays? I'll be quite frank, I don't really see it. Sometimes, mm -hmm. you know, we play uh, one or two sessions and we say, boy, grab a girl, take her around the world, because we used to call it yeah. around the world. Um, you know, when you are whining and everything. Yeah. And um, but hardly not. The man, mm -hmm. they might dance behind the woman, they might what the heck is this about? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no. <laughs> I mean, it's pure, nobody's, it's strange. 
Yeah, but different it. time, different space, so we have to just yeah, know yeah, that's what it is. What God God. Said. <laughs> Everything changes, right? I mean, yeah, for real, generation for real. is a yeah, bit for real. For real. different. For real. But for me, it's a bit disappointing. And mm -hmm. yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Yeah. so if um, would you clash nowadays? Is there a sound you would clash nowadays? I personally not into it. I just find it all a bit kind of. Mm. <sighs> we, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'll be, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I'll be honest with you. Um, song class in a, in Europe, that's still a go on, but in England, that's not a go on. Yeah. Yeah. That's not really a go on. One and two, but not the way it was when you had the Gold Cup. I remember we was even down on uh, Norwood Library, no, right. that's okay. and <laughs> there was five hundred people couldn't come into Norwood Library. They're yes. outside yeah. wanting to come. The the walls were sweating. Mm. Shaka so, sound, Shaka sound. Yeah. Yeah. Us and yeah. us. You don't have those those okay. type of things. Two thousand people. No. So, so you wouldn't clash a foundation sound nowadays? Not really. Not me personally. I can't. Not even for the not even for the for the nostalgia or just the vibe. Yeah, of maybe. The, the maybe. 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 I, my bigger brother and sister went to your, your dances, you know what I mean? I used to come back and they used to hear them talking and me as I used to listen and say, wow! Yeah. You understand? Yeah. That would be great to see you yeah. to come back again. Yeah. And, and it's a possibility, we never say never. Yeah. You know, yeah. Yeah. That's like, the vibes. Yeah. 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 But the right, like, if cocks and them type of man, yeah. 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 That's, that's cool. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we're, we're going to keep it short and sweet, so yeah. I just want to know, do you have anything to say um, for the work that done Sinclair? And, and we're what I think for the sound system culture. Yeah, I think it's a brilliant thing you guys are doing. It's Wonderful. very important that the history is recorded and the history is recorded uh, correctly. Because, uh, uh, you know, I'm not disrespecting anybody, but I'm hearing some people talk and sometimes I think, but this is not true. Or well, this is prefabricated. Why yeah. don't they tell the people true. and inform the people what was going on at the time? It wasn't about me, 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 me. The sound system was an informative, educational part yeah. of our culture Definitely. and yeah. there was no for us in those times hardly any radio hardly any press that we could read so no. when we're talking in the dances we're entertaining and we're also educating educating people. the same uh, you know, on, on that level it, it and then the, the youth them now had something to do they had something to aspire for but now they have nothing mm. the poor youth and that's why you have problem because black youth is not like white youth yeah. You know, and at that time, people would sit down and reason. You would, yeah. uh, uh, you would hear people talk upon the record. May I go down my virgin yard and reason? Mm. Be too domino and reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Like, uh, Can I just add? Sure. Because we need to call some people's names at a I'm foundation. Just gonna, I was just going to say to you. Thank you, you're on the ball, man. Yeah, lovely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Again, it's just good to see the young people coming behind us and they're, they're putting the thing together professionally. Mm -hmm. Because there's no archive for us. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just ridiculous. And I, I, I also want to add, I can't believe that a lot of us in that era, we didn't record nothing visually or, no, no. or audio. On yeah, audio. Some, of, the some of us did, yeah. but it's like, yeah. there's some nothing. Of the big dance. So I just yeah. want to just say, uh, Big U, Irving Juman, foundation member, uh, owner of Mombasa. Gary, who is in Germany, I just left Germany, left Gary in Germany in Dortmund. Okay. Um, he's another foundation member, Beris. Uh, you're familiar with Beris? Yes, yes. yes. Um, and and um, of course Wolfman, yeah. myself. And there's some younger youths which we never seem to uh, call. One is um, Crusoe. Crusoe. Uh, his brother DC. Yeah. Cool uh, Straight. Cool Straight. Uh, Prince Tony. A this, you know, yeah. when bus are coming, they're coming and yeah, passing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not yeah. just one and you two. Like when you see yeah. bus, yeah. bus is like a passing. It's, yeah. like, it's like a, a movement. Yeah. movement. Yeah. Uh, Paul Coates, and there are some other people. Forgive me if I don't yeah. remember the names, yeah. but perhaps we can come back to right. that. Yeah. Another yeah. An answer, I'd just like to one more thing. The songs that will come before me. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, 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 Shelley. Um, 
Sarkozy. Sarko. Sarko. Okay. And all those the Sarko is the first man to have the Warren Twenty. That was Con Sarko's place. Oh. Okay. Where Coxon and all of yeah, yeah. He was the first. Poet Street. Yes, um, yeah. People's Club. People's yeah. Club. Yeah. He, that was his place. Okay. People don't. He's a very important man. Yeah. Um, Safra, uh, Lord Safra, David, Lord Tropical, David. Jesus. Yes. Um, Tropical Down B, yeah. Fanso. Uh, yeah. Who yeah. come before Fat Man. Yeah. yeah, all them man. And those yeah. sounds that we mentioned yes. in the country earlier. Yeah. They yes. already had that on record anyway. And there's loads of sounds in, 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 in London too that we. Mention. Yeah. Well, well, you know what, there's so much I really want to say, there's True. so much we want to talk about but time is running and passing and passing yeah. and running, you know what I mean, and we're running out of time because we still have to feature on some dope place. Mm -hmm. You know what, let me ask you one more thing, yes. what are you up to these days? Uh, me personally, I run a, a small real estate company, I also run a commodity company Okay. Wow. and, and um, I, I run a, a small construction company uh, working in Africa wow. and, and abroad. Yeah. Me, right. uh, me, uh, um, me and my brother, we do like um, we do houses. We generate them and whatever. Okay. Because I did, I, I. That's why we left Mombasa because we had to take care of our kids. True, true. You know what I mean? We had mm. to you know, get this priority right, yes, kind sir. of thing. And that we weren't making our money. We, you know, yeah. a house party. Yeah. You, might, you, you might get tossed upon. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You should name Fox as well. Fox is My brother. Wolfman's brother, so okay. we call him Fox, okay. Wolf and Fox, uh -huh. and blah, blah, blah. And we have to say, you know, big up to the most high, you yeah. know, ever yeah. living, ever faith, and ever sure. Everybody's got different names to him. Um, some people refer to him as sister and what's not, and they say he. Uh, I just say, well, the most high. Yeah. Because they take out human out of everything. Yeah, yeah. You know, and as far as I'm concerned, the most high is man and woman, yes, in the sense that. It is a plural thing. Woman is you know, equal. To mother of woman. creation. Yes, yeah. yeah. So big up to the woman and them and enough love Rastafari. Sure. Yes, you know, through the inspiration of his imperial majesty. Uh, we're still moving forward. Yeah. Yo. Give thanks. Man for Give beer, yeah. Wolfman, enough respect for being part of Dun Sinclair. And there we have it, people. I really want to go on, but we can't because we've got a dog play session for you, <laughs> all right, to chew it into. Okay? So I just want to say, Big up yourself, Dancing Clear. Big up yourself, Unruly Calling. I've been your host for today, Shani T, and this has been a Dancing Clear quick fire interview with the great Moan Bass yeah. Sound. True foundation of the UK. True, true. Trust me. Boom, we're gone. Gone.